to x5p.com. Use code CUTE at checkout. Link down below in the comments of me buying coins off this website so you can see how to do it step by step. Stop gambling your money. Go save your money. Right now, 500k is below $9. So stop wasting your money. All right, guys. We are back. Top 10 running backs. And I already did the top 10 quarterbacks and the top 10 cornerbacks. Both of those videos are out already. I do at least our videos today. Subscribe if you're new. I have a new channel, guys. The link is in the comments. Go subscribe over there if you do. It means everything to me. Thank you so much. All love. And let's go ahead and get started there. Number 10 is Hackens. This guy here with low agility makes his Jugend spin don't feel like a 99. They really don't. So he's over 200 pounds. He can run people over. He does not catch good in traffic, and this holds true in the gameplay. I was not impressed throwing the ball to him. So, I wish his abilities were better. I wish he broke more tackles. That's why he's not higher on the list. Let's see who number nine is. Barry Sanders is number nine. Now, 99 Excel is still great. His juke and spin is amazing. His cod is amazing. This guy here shifts gears so fast, so easy. But what's wrong with Barry Sanders? can't truck he cannot run people over he breaks a good amount of tackles but he doesn't break tackles like a power back uh so do keep that in mind um he doesn't get bulldozer so there's gonna be times where you can't just run by somebody you need to run through somebody and right then you're gonna be caught because he's not well rounded like that you can't just run someone over so do keep that in mind is he fun yes is he good yes who's next falk is a lot like barry but just well Better route running, better catching. And yes, uh, 400K is not too bad. Playmaker for zero. If you know how to abuse that, it's pretty fun. This guy is shifty. Now, if you just need a guy to dump the ball off to and let him do some work, you can spend, he's going to feel great. I love this card for his catching. He catches more balls than you think. So if that fits your scheme, go get him. And Danny and Thomason just feel so much better as a runner than Falk. But, of course, Falk is going to be a good receiving bat. But look, so is Lindanian. So, he's going to break more tackles than Falk. I'm going to tell you right now, I like this card better than Falk. Um, if you've not used Lindanian, go, go try him out. Play America for zero. He's going to be pretty similar. But, I'm going to tell you right now, this card here, I just feel like I got more button battles than I did with Falk. Go try LT. He's fun. Up next is a new golden ticket. It's... LaShawn McCoy. He feels good. He breaks good amount of tackles. Not the best. His catching obviously is amazing. This card catches like the best in the game besides Flash. So uh, I wish his abilities were better for sure. Why did we repeat this? I don't know. Uh, I would have loved to see Bulldozer on him or Bruiser on him for zero since he's a speed back. I like to see some, you know, a little of both worlds. Uh, he cannot truck, so he's not higher on the list. That's it, guys. He's not going to break the most tackle. He's done with the truck, so he's not super well-rounded. Now, making this list is hard because it depends how what you need, right? If you need one guy to fall forward at the goal line, it's the quad father. His X Factor is so hard to shut off. And, yeah, he is slow. But if you're talking about just going up the middle, guys, he's amazing. If you're going outside, go get McCoy. It depends how you want to play. He's under 100K right now. That's just stupid. And this card is still amazing. Uh, it, it depends, guys. It really does. He's too slow now. Defense is 99 speed. But if you just need somebody to fall forward, you can still spam this guy. He's still effective. He's on the list. Henry is a direct upgrade because, well, he gets Bruiser for zero. Uh, his X Factor is amazing. That's why he's higher. If you guys are new to the game, go get the freight train x factor and watch him just throw people to the ground it's amazing uh x factor uh a lot of people got away from these running backs but they're still really effective guys and yes i would say uh using him for bruiser for zero and then short and leave for one's amazing king henry is still good robinson is next this guy's amazing uh you talk about the best for zero ap running back i say it's him actually when the x is not turned on, guys, this guy breaks more tackles than they do. Uh, Bruiser for zero. He's fast, runs by people, runs three people. He catches just fine at a 90. And yes, go get Robinson. You're going to love him. Gus the Bus is next. 
6-1, over 200 pounds. This guy gets Bruiser for zero. So if you just need a power back with his X-Factor activated, this guy's insane. I love him, but he's not the best at catching. He does not catch like Flash. His Juke and Spin does not feel like Flash. His Juke and Spin is usable, but man, it feels a little bit bulky. He doesn't get the best animations on that, but as a power back, he's amazing. All right, guys, and number one is still Flash. His Juke and Spin animations are just amazing. His route running is great. He gets great separation. So even if you just throw the ball, go get him because he's going to be the best receiving back in the game because he is 6'2", and he can spec catch. He can jump over people. He's amazing. His X Factor is great. Go activate Phenom. You're going to love it. And he gets good abilities. Evasive for zero. I'm going to tell you something. You don't even need that on him. Uh, this guy breaks tackles. He gets good button battles. I love him. He can run over the smaller, like, cornerbacks. I wouldn't try to run over, like, a Patrick Willis or something. But that's going to do for me, guys. Be kind for no reason. Go check out my other channel. I do at least three videos every day over there. If you subscribe over there, you made my day. All love. Thank you so much, guys. It means everything if you guys subscribe over there. Now, be kind for no reason. It's always the message. I'll see you in the next video. Special shout out to Justin Ashley for joining the channel. If you guys want to shout out in the video, all you do is join the channel. Thank you for all support. It means everything.